Hello, Jodie here from Jolly Natural Skincare, and today I wanted to show you how I get crazy knots out of my children's hair and how hair styling wax plays a part in that. So, firstly, because the hair is dry, we'll start with the brush and we'll start in segments. Always starting from the bottom and working your way up. And see here we've got a nice dreadlock forming. Holding as tightly as you can here. So you try not to pull their hair. Which in this case might prove to be impossible. explain what a dreadlock is. A dreadlock? Oh, I think the whole world knows what a dreadlock is. Although this is an informal dreadlock. This is just the hair rubbing on something so often that it's turned into a knot. Hmm. Deadly. Just trying to tease that knot out, even though it sounds like I'm yanking his hair. You are. <laughs> I am. This is a particu particularly big knot. Not that just doesn't want to come out. Alrighty, now you can see what's happened here is it's gone frizzy from where that knot has been. So, this is where hairstyle and wax comes into play. You really just don't need much. And his leg is my stand, and then we just rub our hands together and just smooth that down the area where the hair is frizzy. What that'll do is moisturise that hair and potentially help undo the damage that we just did with that pulling and yanking. So another option that we have is with a, a knot this big and horrendous, we can get some more hair styling wax and rub it into the hair. Now this has fundamentally left the hair wet sort of technically wet, so we'll go in with a comb. That's right, we'll get that later. Yeah, nobody needs a lid. Wow, what have you got in the tip of your hair? It's like lolly. Yelch, and I didn't put any hair wax there, so sorry about that yanking. So what the hair wax does is it helps the comb slide through a little bit easier. 
And so if I try that with the brush and the hair wax in, we'll see how that goes. Just grab the knot itself and work from the base. Trying to be as gentle with the hair as you can. You want to minimise the amount of split ends that you'll create from getting a knot out like this. What are you guys doing? Oh, I hear somebody whistling and interrupting our filming. See him, his reaction, doesn't it? No. No, you can't see anything under all that hair? No. All right, switching back to the comb. Let's work in segments. This is much more painful than all the other times. Well, this is the hugest knot I've ever seen you have. And not that I, you know, want to throw you under the bus on the national television, national YouTubing. <laughs> when was the last time you brushed your hair? It's got to be at least a day or two. Three. Yeah, and it looks like you've had um, a collar on, like a shirt or a, wrapped in your blankie too much. It's probably my jacket, actually. Your jacket, yeah, hooded jackets, they're the worst for this kind of thing. So I, I feel that even with the wax in and the dry hair, the brush is definitely working better. But it's still really hard to get right in the middle of this knot. I can see as I'm brushing the wax in here, keeping the hair moisturised and less brittle. It sort of makes it more flexible, less um, dry, less fragile, less, less snappable, less breakable. I think you get my point. But it is interesting that you can see it in the hair. It looks sort of shiny where the wax is. You see that big knot is still there, but it's slowly getting teased out. I just hope that's the last knot. Possibly. Is this hurting less than the other one? No. Ah. Well, hair wax doesn't stop your head from hurting. There we go, folks. You heard it here. Mind you, I'm not exactly doing a very good job at holding the base of your hair. So what the hair wax has also done is stopped this whole clump of hair from being frizzy. See how it's not frizzy like the front part was when it was when the knot was teased out. This has actually made his hair frizz free. Look at that, it's beautiful. Beautiful and shiny. And I think that we've minimized the damage as much as we can considering the size of that knot. More tips that have got something in them. Have you been chewing on your hair? No. Okay, sometimes that um, can cause it to clump together. And some people we do with long hair do have that fetish. They love chewing on their hair. They like the feel of it, the taste of it.
often with the odd knot, that he would. This one has escaped me, but not quite. Boots. There we go. Have a look at that. Beautiful, knot free, silky, shiny hair. A little bit more hair styling wax. I'll just run a bit here on the sides where it was a little bit frizzy to start with. Look at that gorgeous, glossy hair. And there you have it folks, how to tease out knots and tame the frizz and have your hair be more malleable when you're combing and brushing using Jolly's Natural Hair Styling Wax. And as usual, thanks for watching. Thumbs up. Whoa. <laughs> <laughs>